Welcome to the pre-assessment FMO guide for cable craning, otherwise known as Skyline. My name's Sarah Chapman, I'm from MJ Wood Services, and I'm joined today by Michael Crutchley. Hello. Who's an MPTC assessor and Lantra trainer, and is a forestry contractor with 20 years experience. And Mike will be sharing his knowledge with us today on the skills that you need to demonstrate during your FMO cable crane assessment. This is one of seven videos on the cable crane assessment and you will need to watch these in conjunction with our base machine videos which also cover your health and safety, hazards and risks and PPE. We already assume you have a good level of skill. This is not a training video. So we have, assume you have a good level of skill for using the Skyline or cable crane. And we always recommend that you seek formal training and read the qualification guidance. These videos would not be possible without the support of Forestry Focused Future, an innovative training scheme, and Callum Campbell of Forest Services Limited from Hunkless for the use of his machines, crew and site today. This is video six in our Skyline pre-assessment guide and in this we'll be demonstrating the full operation. So the winchman's received a clear command from the chokerman to send out the carriage. We're looking for the correct speed, good control. And the chokerman will give the command to stop the carriage in the right position over the timber. Once again, working at a safe distance. You give the command to pay out some slack. So they can choker the timber, making sure it's done in the right order so as to prevent the least problem when hauling up to the carriage. Again, moving to a safe distance, giving a clear command to haul in the timber to the carriage. Chokerman once again, once it's at the carriage, give a command to lock the carriage, release the brake and haul up. Again, we're looking for the appropriate speed, that it's safe. And once at the landing site, lower the timber and release the chokers. Once again, if you're manually releasing chokers, it's important to observe health and safety when moving over stacked timber. The timbers are ready for onward processing here by the harvester. It's important to look after your equipment that you check your chokers and damage equipment are reported and taken out of service, ready for repair. And as previously demonstrated, release the tension and lower the tower. Here the harvester is processing into chip bar log as required, ready for fording.